Yes. Hello. Thanks for coming. You are freezing. Aren't you? I'm sorry, it's cold out there. Thank you for coming at quarter to eight in the morning to Hamlet's. There is your goodie bag. Thank you. Don't eat them all now. You make yourself sick. There's five floors. We're going to have a walk right up to the top and stop over at various spots on the way. I just want you to get a sense of the store, and because I haven't really told you what we're going to do at all, have I? No, you have no idea. <laughs> Not okay. clear. Lovely. Let's just have a little walk around first, so you you're familiar with the layout. Do you have a favourite toy when you were little? Oh, I, I quite like Barbies, I suppose. So this is soft toys. Uh, let's head up here. For a, let's go for a wander around. Chess, get your photo taken. This is your games. We'll go up another one. More toys. Did you have any uh, books when you were little? Yeah, I loved reading. It's amazing how much you... Um, Absorb unconsciously, even just looking at these now. When you're mm. when you're when you're little, how much sticks in the mind without even being aware of it? Let's keep going. Finding dolls. Oh yeah. Dolls house. I remember I had a, like a big dolphin that I used to play with quite a lot. As oh, so you like cuddly toys too. Yeah. Certainly had a lot of some boys' toys, really. Up to the top. Okay. So that is all five or so floors of families. Okay. Um, now you've had a chance just to kind of get a basic sense of the layout of the store, I'm going to ask you to now go on a bit of a wander. Okay. Back down through the levels of the shop yourself and to select a toy, but only sort of mentally select a toy. Very important you don't give away what this toy is. So we're not going to follow you with the cameras. Okay. But imagine that you were being followed and you wouldn't want to give away to anybody what it was. So you don't need to pick this toy up. All you need to do is mentally go, okay, that one, and take your goodie bag and have a wander around. See you in a bit. See ya. Okay, you've had a wander? Yeah. Chosen something? Found yep. something? Yeah. Uh, first of all, you haven't told anybody what it is. No one's asked you. No. no one's filming you. No. In your mind, be very clear what it is. Be very clear where it is. And uh, I'll be asking you all sorts of questions. But unless I say answer out loud, don't answer out loud. You're just answering in your head. Actually, we can start going, no, it wouldn't be up here because we didn't really get a look up here. So um, let's go down to this okay. floor here. Okay, this is sort of quite boys' stuff up here. This is definitely the boys' floor. And as you think about this, um, can you imagine, so don't answer out loud, but in your mind, is this somebody, if you were going to give this toy as a gift to somebody, just in your mind, imagine giving it to this person, how they would, how they look at me. Yeah, I think, I don't think, I think it's a girl's thing. Let's go down. I think this is a girl. You've got, it's a girl in your mind, isn't it? You're going to give it to, yeah. Um, give nothing away, you just answer in your head. Your friend's name, though, as you were saying it in your mind, nothing out loud, just certainly, my, it's got a, a lip, uh, a V, Vicky, is it Vicky? Yeah. Yes? <laughs> yes. Okay. Good. Okay. Okay. Let's just clear all those out of your head so you can just keep focusing on this toy. Uh, imagine giving it to Vicky. So you're going here. I got it. Uh, it's over here. Okay, come back over here. Okay, just start to think warmer, colder in your head. Warmer, colder, warmer, colder. So you're telling me where to go. You're saying nothing out loud, but you're telling me warmer, colder. Warmer, hotter, hotter, colder, okay, colder, cold. This is colder, isn't it? <laughs> and then warmer's over here. I think, I think she's more cats than dogs, but a dog, chimp, giraffe, say nothing. I think it's one of these three. Okay, you look at that one first, it won't be that. present you're going to give Vicky. I think by the fact you're trying not to move your eyes over there, I think, am I right, and I'm going to commit to this, there are a quarter of a million toys in this store, I think the present you're going to give Vicky is, is the giraffe, am I right? Yeah. Yes? Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> God. Well, there you go. i give that to Vicky with my, uh, with my compliments. It's, uh, wow. Incidentally, if you were going to give that a name, what would you call it? Frank? Yeah. That's a good that's a good name for giraffe, it's not too obvious. Uh, well enjoy Oh by the way, in your goodie bag, you've had this on you all the time, haven't you? Yeah. By the way, if you, you see the, 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 the tissue, there's a few sweets, but the tissue paper is right. If you open it up, there's a little extra thing when you give this to Vicky. I thought it'd be quite a nice touch just to uh this little name collar. Just a <laughs> and just show just show the camera there so they can see it. It just ties around the neck. I thought it'd be a quite sweet little oh present. My God. Oh, can we just show the camera again? It didn't quite get that. You got it? <laughs> Excellent. And uh, while you're here. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, good luck getting in the car. <laughs> How do you do that? 
Do you feel like a free choice? Yeah, completely. Yeah. I didn't so even, I didn't, like, I didn't even decide on Frank first. That was like, I went for a few names. You first. did, yeah. You were changing yeah. your mind. They've been amazing. Oh, Thank you so much. You were absolutely brilliant. Thank Have a lovely so day. I'll let you yeah, chat to you. Too. Oh, thanks. <laughs> oh, it's really like, like overwhelming. Like, I have no idea, like, how he would know that before I even sort of came up with it. It like, felt like such a free choice. <laughs> Quite surreal, but really exciting. A really good fun. And Alice is here with us at the moment. Round of applause for Alice. <laughs> Few of you clearly were getting a giraffe as well. Do you know why you were thinking of giraffe too? Would you believe me if I told you that I actually mimed a giraffe to her as soon as she came in through the doors? Oh, you, you picked up on it. I'll show you a couple of the things that, that we did. So we're going to have a walk right up to the top and stop over at various spots on the way. <laughs> Various spots, various spots on the way. See it again? So we're gonna have a walk right up the top and stop over at various spots on the way. And then as we went in, I actually said giraffe right too. I don't know if you caught this, so you have to listen carefully, but uh, keep going. Do you have a favorite toy when you were little? <laughs> and again? Is, is, do you have a favorite toy when yeah. you were little? I don't know where the northern accent came from, that's giraffe, yeah? And there were loads of other subliminals throughout the store. A giraffe face printed on these t-shirts. With UV light, you can now see the word giraffe on the books we looked at. We placed pictures of giraffes on the escalators and on the walls and giraffe print patterns all around the store too. We even had letters spelling the word giraffe hanging from the ceiling. So with all these subliminal messages, when Alice went off to make her selection, I was confident she would choose a giraffe. Thank you, Alice. Well done. And that's perception without awareness. And this is just the start.